Okay, a um, couple weeks ago I ordered this, anticipating that I was going to mount this on the front of that cheap Chinese signal generator, which I am not going to be getting, and I hopefully will get a refund from it. <clears throat> I got nothing but bad luck with eBay these days. This does not work. It's got a beautifully bright display, but the uh, frequency reads all zero. Now, this is an SMA connector, female, but when I ordered my cable, I ordered BNC to SMA, it fits right on there, but this is SMA female. Well, that's what happens when you don't pay attention, I guess. So, the only way I was able to try that is put a clip lead on the barrel of that SMA connector and stick a piece of wire down in there connected to my signal generator. That's why I know that it does not work. So we're going to try it again on video here. I wrote to seller and I made very sure that it does not work and told him that all it does is light up. It shows all zeros on it, um, 0, 0.000 megahertz and that's it. What I got here is 703 kilocycles going from my signal generator into this, into my Rube Goldberg setup here because the SMA wire that I bought with the connector on it, I bought the wrong one. So um, I hope you can see that. Zero, 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 nothing. Now there's a switch on the side. You turn that off, turn that on, nothing. So it's fitting in there tight. It's in the hole. The wire is coaxial RG174 and going up to my ICO 324 signal generator. So the thing is not working. It is not working at all. I will take you up to the other frequency counter and show you that I am indeed getting 703 kilocycles. So you can plainly see I'm getting 703 KC and fraction thereof out of here because here's my uh, output. Here's my RG174 that's running down to this thing. So obviously this thing is no good. So I don't recommend buying these things. They're unreliable. It wasn't a sealed package. It came in this all sealed up. As a matter of fact, it contained Chinese air in it. When I cut it open, I made sure I held my breath. Uh, so it was sealed. It wasn't crushed or anything like that in the mail. There is no other adjustment that I can see. There is a little thing right here where my thumb is. Thumbs were invented before pointers. Right there. Okay. See that? Kind of a yellowish looking thing. I don't know what it is. Now, if something else has to be used with this, we'll just forget it. Because that's the story of my life. I've seen YouTube videos on these things, people using them on uh, signal generators, and they seem to work. I was originally going to cut out a hole in the front of that signal generator that I'm not now getting. And mount this inside and power it by way of the circuitry in the signal generator instead of using the battery the only problem would be this on and off switch would have to be on off switch would have to be left on all the time i take it that that is an on and off switch it doesn't seem to do anything else but turn it on and off and maybe reset it we're still getting the signal in it and i got my signal generator maxed out i will try turning it down all right Let's get this adjusted. 
try to get it right on 700 KC. Close as I can figure it. I get it. Uh, that's as good as I can get it. Now let's go down to the little tiny frequency counter and see what we got. I turned this to medium, 50%. Let's see what we got down below. No, that's way off. It's 700 KC, not 5.4 whatever megahertz. So this thing is way off base. So when I wrote the cello, I said it's not working. So it isn't working. So don't buy one of these things. Um, this one might be defective. Maybe these things just don't work. I don't know. It's supposed to be good. As far as I know, it's supposed to be good down to audio range. Again, these auctions have very, very fine print. And it's so difficult for me to see even with a magnifying glass. On band C, we're on two megacycles. One nine 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 five point zero zero. So two megacycles. But well, take a look at this. Well, you can see there's your two megacycles, six point seven nine megacycles. These things are way off. Useless, like a lot of things from China. So, um, I don't recommend buying one of these. The only reason I bought this, I know I have two frequency counters, the only reason I bought it is I was going to build it right into the panel of the signal generator. And I'm sure as hell glad that if I had gotten that signal generator, they would cut a hole in the front mounting this and found out that this thing here is a POS because... There's your two mega cycles. Poop is in the pudding. This thing here is no good. So I hope I get a refund on it. There was thirteen dollars and change plus the tax, and I think it was free shipping. So that's the third. That's the third item. From eBay, so I'm not. I'm striking out. Everything in 2020 is going to hell. All right, I'm on band D. Seven mega cycles right there. Seven mega cycles right there. Let's check this a little one. Out. There's your seven mega cycles. All right. The bottom line is, don't buy this. It's a piece of crap. About the only thing this is good for is a night light. It's definitely very bright. Makes a good night light. That's about all it's good for.